Good morning, students. Today we will start science lesson eight: light and shadows. As we know that light help us to see things present around us. The sun and the moon are the natural sources of light energy. Students, here a question arises that how light help us to see things. So the answer is. When the light falls on an object, it gets reflected from the object and enters our eyes to form an image of that object. Different objects allow different amount of light to pass through them, while some objects do not allow light to pass through them. So, based on these properties, objects are classified as transparent object. Translucent object and opaque objects. So now let us see these different types of objects. The first type of object is the transparent object. There are some objects which allow the light to pass through them. These objects are called transparent objects. For example, clear glass, clean water, air, etc. Here in the example, you can see from this source of light, when it falls on a clean glass, on the other side, whatever objects are kept there, you can see them clearly. So this clean glass acts as a transparent object. Next comes the translucent objects. There are some objects which do not allow full light. To pass through them, these objects are called translucent objects. For example, dirty water, tracing paper, muslin cloth, colored glass, etc. In this example, you can see the source of light falls on a muslin cloth, and only it allows some light to pass through them. So this muslin cloth acts as a translucent object. The third and the last is the opaque objects. There are some objects which do not allow light to pass through them. They are called opaque objects. For example, book, paper, duster, wooden chair, steel plate, etc. In this example, you can see that this book acts as an op opaque objects which do not allow light to pass through them. So children today's explanation part is over your assignment is to read these three different types of objects thank you